It's a gorgeous morning here in West Michigan. Time to fire up the smoker, make some barbecue. Today we're doing pulled pork. Let's make some pork butt. We're gonna just lather it uh, with a little bit of yellow mustard. Uh, that just helps all of the seasoning adhere. Stay on, it really doesn't affect the flavor. You could just use oil if you wanted. I like to keep one clean hand and then one hand that I rub that has a glove on it. Okay, so we're just gonna take that plus my barbecue rub. It's gonna go all over, don't forget the sides. There you go, let's go smoke this fat side up. Pork butt in, we are smoking this at 275. Okay, so we've spritzed our pork butt a few times with apple cider vinegar and some apple juice. I do two parts apple juice to one part apple cider vinegar. Let's check our probe temps right here. We're at 166. I like to pull um, between 165 and 175, and that's what I like to wrap. All right, so once we've gotten a nice bark on the outside, we're just gonna wrap it with some pink butcher paper or some foil. So all we're gonna do is just start, and some people also add a little bit of some more of the apple juice or apple cider vinegar, just keep this nice and uh, juicy. That's all we really want is to wrap this up, throw it back in the smoker, and it's just to keep, retain all those juices. Okay, so after wrapping, we're gonna place those probes back in, Gonna let this go until we reach that internal temperature of 205. Side dish for barbecue, uh, local Michigan asparagus. So I'm gonna smoke some asparagus and some lemon, and we just put some oil along with some Michigan cherry wood smoke seasoning all over, and we're gonna go just throw that right onto here, throw that on the smoker, and we will see you soon. Right, so when the bone pulls straight out, we're just gonna discard the bone and then we are gonna just shred this up. Look at the bark on that, bark and smoke ring. All right, here we go. Oh my goodness, so juicy, so flavorful. I cannot wait to dig into this. And let me show you all the ways that we're gonna eat it. Asparagus and lemon that we smoked and then we're just gonna just drizzle that all over. And now let's go eat some barbecue. All right, so we uh, made all of the pulled pork in the smoker. Now it's time to eat. So look at, we have dogs and humans ready to eat. We have pulled pork sandwiches. We have tacos. We have some nachos. And of course we smoked the asparagus along with some lemon. So. All right, everyone excited for National Barbecue Day? Oh yeah. yeah. Perfect. Uh, check it all out in my cookbook, Meals from the Mitten. And even if you don't have a smoker, you can always make pulled pork in your slow cooker. I have great recipes in there, so check it out. And recipes will be up on the website.